The infestation by the fall armyworms, especially in the major maize-producing regions in western Kenya and North Rift, brought uncertainties as to whether the country's food basket would survive the attack. While there had been preliminary reports that maize harvests, especially in Transoya County, one of Kenya's biggest maize-producing regions, would reduce by almost 50 percent. New findings indicate the situation is not as bad as projected earlier. According to Transoya County Agriculture Officer Mary Nzomo, about 9% of the maize will be lost due to the fall armyworm invasion. We had estimated the damage uh, from the fall armyworm to be at about 30%. Uh, and that is uh, from, a, from an initial target of about 5.3 million bags from the county. We had expected to, to come to about 4.5 million. This was supported by interventions by the government to contain the worm, which has seen most farmers salvage the crop and anticipate a good harvest. We still lost a bit because by the time now we, we acquired the chemicals, already the pest had attacked some fields. Nzomo says the county also has surplus maize from last year's harvest, which should cover the deficit. We are still food secure because uh, the requirements of the county is about 1 million bucks. So as a county, we still have enough food and we still have a bit of surplus which can be offloaded to the food deficit areas. But while the overall harvest in the county looks good, individual farmers are not smiling. Joram Juguna says the infestation from the worm has left him with a harvest of about 700 bags of maize from his 40 acres compared to about 900 bags under good conditions. Wakao. Tume tulirima mwezi wa tatu nikapanda tarehe 28 maidi ya kwanza lakini tutakaa mwezi mzima bila mvua maidi yote ilihalibika nikarudi kwa shamba tukaliplow sasa hii ya pili na ikawa kuwa affected na hii armyworms sasa kwa saa hii maidi yetu si vile inakuanga Edward Cairo, who had 50 acres under the maize crop, is pessimistic about any harvest since his entire crop was affected by the pest and poor weather. Wakati kuna mbua wadudu wanapungua, wakati mbua inakwisha, jua inarudi, na wadudu wanablow tena, wanaongezeka. Kwa hivyo mini jaribu kupiga dawa karibu maratatu. This is however not the case for Mary Ngugi, who says despite her maize being affected by the pest, she is expecting a bumper harvest thanks to interventions by county agricultural officers. Vile agriculture officer wetu, wali introduce hiyo dawa, sasa tulijaribu kupiga na, na matukatumia hile njia tulieto. In a bid to avert such challenges in future, Nzomo has drafted a bill that will be presented to the county assembly aimed at controlling growing of maize off-season, which acts as a host of the pest before the planting season. Ruth Mutegi, Newsar Business.